What's up guys, John and Amanda here from Legacy Home, and we're standing here in front of our latest duplex conversion project in Kitchener. We are super excited to show you what we've done with this place. At the beginning, it wasn't much to look at, but now it looks amazing. Let's go check it out. All right, wow. Wow. Looks amazing like, in I here. just can't believe how awesome this turned out. Yeah, this is great. This place was like grandma's house before we took it over, and yeah. now look at it. All new paint, floors, trim, brand new kitchen. There yeah. actually used to be a half wall right here with a pillar dividing the kitchen and the living room. Remember that? Yeah, it was really old and dated. Yeah. 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 It, it, it gave you a good place to sit though when there was no, yeah. no seating when yeah. we were working on it. <laughs> yeah, that was uh, a great area. So, so yeah. remember right around here, this actually was more countertop and cupboards that wrapped around here from the kitchen. Mm -hmm. Now yep. check it out. With a doorway there. Yeah. There's a doorway. So. There was a doorway into the hallway right here. We moved that. Now we got laundry. This uh, is raised up because the stairs going down to the basement from, from the upstairs here um, had a little bit of, there's an angled ceiling below here. Mm -hmm. So we raised it up and put side-by-side -side washer dryer um, on top. Makes it really easy to do laundry for people right here. It's kind of right in front of you. And we have some storage below. Yeah, that turned out really nice. And I love like, it's still the kitchen. It's a little bit smaller, but like, it's so bright with these white cabinets and yeah, it's really um, modern. New white shaker cabinets, uh, brand new stainless steel appliances mm -hmm. in here. Huge double stainless steel sink with the black faucet. Yeah. Um, this is just looking fantastic. And nice. then we closed it off here too. This was, yep. was open for the basement unit. So now it's all closed off with the panel for the upstairs. Yeah, we separated the electrical too. So we've got a panel upstairs mm -hmm. and a panel downstairs. So um, each tenant can pay for their own uh, utilities if needed. Um, and we got the four by 16 white uh, tile backsplash as well. So it's looking nice and clean and modern. What a transformation. Yeah, yeah it looks amazing. Let's go check out the living room. Yeah, it's so open now and that wall gone. And yeah. The so ceiling bright. was like the old school uh, design in the, in the ceiling. So they flattened yeah. it, um, put nice modern LED pot lights. It's so bright in here. We've got the big mm -hmm. bay window and that uh, just yeah. nice and open from the kitchen to the living room. Yeah. And with this doorway moved now, like we closed that and put this doorway here. So now this is the new entrance into the hallway. Yeah, I think it's so awesome that we turned this two bedroom bungalow into three bedrooms. Yeah, I think when it was yeah. first built, it was a three bedroom. They didn't need mm -hmm. the third bedroom. So they yeah. opened this wall completely up and made yeah. a dining room there. And that was, you know, in 2021, it's kind of a waste of space, right? I yeah, mean, a lot of people are looking for the three bedrooms nowadays. So. And almost nobody uses a dining room anymore. Yeah. So we closed the wall off, turned it into a third bedroom, and it actually has the slider out to the back deck, which is perfect for a master bedroom. I think it was a good idea yeah. to make this an Airbnb because, you know, seeing it furnished is amazing. Yeah, I love seeing the transformation with furniture in the house. It looks awesome. Yeah, so uh -huh. right behind you over here, there was a huge opening that led from the living room into the dining room. This was the dining room. So we closed that off and now it's the master bedroom with a big slider out to the new deck. Let's go check out the next bedroom. Three yeah. bedrooms in this place, uh, three bedrooms up and down. So it's a nice big place. Another bedroom here, you can see the huge windows in these bedrooms. There used to be a roof over top of the deck and it made these rooms super dark. So we took it down and redid the whole deck, made it beautiful outside and tons of natural light coming in the bedrooms now as well. Yeah, makes it nice and bright in here. All right, off to the third bedroom. Do you remember what this used to look like? Yeah, that was terrible. You wanted <laughs> okay, to keep it. We're gonna cut to the before video right now and show you what this used to look like. Unreal, there was just all wood, uh, kind of tilted slats. Uh, there was actually cupboard, weird cupboard doors um, up top that kind of looked like sideways California shutters. Yeah. And so we modernized it, now, made it a nice big closet. So much better. All right, let's go check out the bathroom. So much brighter in here. Love yeah, this. so there was a big, yeah. gold, weird gold shower door here. Old tub with an ugly surround. So we gutted the whole thing, put all new, uh, you know, tile surround on it, brand new soaker tub, and uh, obviously put a nice modern curtain up. Yeah, pretty much everything is, is brand new here. Brand new vanity with the black fixtures, new mirrors, mm -hmm. light fixtures. and light fixtures, and yeah. uh, Nice white marble style tile as well. Yeah, you want to go check out downstairs? Yeah, let's Get go it. check out the basement. All right, 
right, we're here in the basement unit. And no. wow, it looks amazing down here. This is yeah. where the real change happened. Yeah. Like, I mean, if you thought upstairs was nice, this is the spot. Yeah. This was super dark. The ceilings were low. The basement used to be finished, but then they kind of ripped it apart and everything was DIY. So yeah. it just looked like crap. You remember when uh, over where the laundry is and this is the first bedroom down here, it used to be that old bar. Oh in the yeah, 70s. that was terrible with the mirrors. It had the mirrors yeah. behind. It had like the red leather like padding along the side of the bar and it was just yeah. so old and run down. And so now, now it's a bedroom and a laundry area. So yeah. much better use of space. And then the floors, do you remember what it used to look like when we yeah, bought it? Yeah, it was like they like tore up the carpet. And it was and just, it was just glue, black, black glue dirty all glue over. all over. Yeah. So just the way it looks now is incredible when you think back to what it looked like before. I know. Now, look, take a look. I mean, we got nice smooth ceilings, pot lights everywhere. Remember the shelves that were oh along this wall? It looked like a yeah. honeycomb. It was just all weird yeah. shelves. And there was a little window right here. One tiny window in yeah. this whole room. Now check it out. Two three by three egress windows, so tons of natural light. You, you can even forget that you're in a basement in this one. Uh, yeah, huge so kitchen down here. This one actually yeah. ended up being bigger than upstairs just because of the layout. Mm -hmm. uh, we've, we've got the same um, beautiful uh, countertop, shaker style cabinets, stainless steel appliances. We even did yeah. some open shelving there in the corner, which looks really, really good. Yeah, I think it fits nicely in that spot because of the distance yeah. with the window. So yeah, it looks yeah, really it's good. amazing. And then just yeah. nice open concept kitchen, living room area here. So tons of space to move around. and. You know, you don't feel like you're in a basement that's not, not cramped at all. Yeah, no, it's really nice. Let's check out the first yeah. bedroom right here. Yeah, and we fit three bedrooms down yeah, here, which bedrooms. is so awesome. <laughs> when you do duplex conversion projects, three up and three down is like... A gold mine. Yeah, gold mine. Yeah, you, 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 hit, you hit the jackpot on that yeah. one. So, oh, and we put uh, our laundry yeah. here. So that laundry. looks amazing there. So, uh, yeah, both, both tenants get the, their own laundry, which is awesome. Mm -hmm. So this is the smallest room in the house. Um, but hey, we got a third bedroom in here, so it makes us happy. Oh yeah. Happened to be where the water meter is though. So we had, yeah. to, we, we had I, to hide it, but. I love this cabinet though, cause it doesn't really look like there should be anything there. Like yeah. it, it fits nicely. It's a good way to hide it. Yeah. For sure. I love it. And then this closet actually, you can see it's like a little hobbit door. I'm, I'm not usually too tall for anything, but I got a duck to get in here. And uh, we use this as the closet. So we didn't have to actually take up additional space in the room to have a closet. All right, let's go check out the rest of the place here. So as you walk through into this hallway, this actually used to be just one giant room. There was the laundry over here. Yeah. There was the water heater. We kind of cleaned everything up and we were able to fit a huge bathroom and two big bedrooms here. So we actually moved the water heater over here by the furnace, which makes a heck of a lot more sense. Uh, there was a water softener over there as well, which is now gonna be, um, and the brand new one's gonna be installed in there. And then we were able to get this bedroom here with a nice big window. So this is my favorite room uh, in the basement because of all the natural light coming in here and how big it is. Yeah, we had a window over here that was covered up by the deck, so we couldn't reuse that window. Yeah. So that's why we, and we had to have a certain amount of light in here. So we installed this nice Yeah, we blocked window. off that window and cut out a whole new window right there, yeah. which is just phenomenal. That's amazing. Yeah. yeah. And then as we walk through this hallway here, you'll see we've got Spot, uh, spot here for a nice linen closet. So we've got tons of space in there. Another bedroom right there. Yep, third bedroom right there. All right, the, yeah, the bathroom. The bathroom. Another this, big transformation. This yeah, is huge. It looks amazing. Remember how there was like that little yeah. like closet with the toilet? Yeah, it was just and, a wooden box with a door on yeah. it. And all it had was a toilet. There was no toilet sink or toilet anything. Toilet paper. There oh, was... Okay, I guess. <laughs> And there if you wonder, no how are they sink. washing their hands? But there was yeah. a laundry tub right here where I'm standing. So yeah. that must have been where they washed their hands. With the washer but and now the dryer. We got rid of the laundry, we got rid of the, the water heater in here. Beautiful yeah. double vanity, huge space. Yeah. Again, we've got the nice subway tile, the, the uh, ceramic marble tile. Uh, just like, it looks it makes way more sense. Amazing. So when we first bought this place, the ductwork that ran through this basement was actually quite large. So there was no way we were gonna get the ceiling height that we needed. So we had the HVAC guy reduce the size of the ductwork, but we still ended up falling a little bit short on the uh, height requirement. So that's why we had to actually paint the side of the bulkhead a different color. 
Yeah, and I think it turned out okay. It turned out great. Yeah. yeah. You'll actually notice here that the color of this bulkhead is different on the side. Uh, in order for this to pass inspection, we actually needed to paint it because the ceiling height is a tad low for our building code. So what we had to do was just make it a color that was just more visible so that any tall, taller people uh, wouldn't hit their heads. Yeah, and I like how that I painted it just on the side. Yeah, because when you're, when you're walking down the hallway, you don't even really notice it, so. I can't believe how awesome it looks back here now. Like we used to have this ugly roof covering the deck. Terrible. It was, yeah, aw yeah. awful, yeah. The, the, these bedrooms on the main floor were so dark because mm -hmm. the roof came all the way across an here angle. and yeah. no sunlight was getting in and it was super ugly. I'm pretty mm -hmm. sure they made a bar, a DIY bar yes, under here as well. Yes, they did. It had cabinets and everything. And when we <laughs> demolished it, there was beer caps everywhere. Did you did you see that? No. There were beer caps all, all along the uh, underneath the deck boards. Yeah. So we took that down. There was a bunch of damage caused to the uh, soffits here. So we had a siding company come in and fix all of it. And we ripped up all the deck boards and put yeah. nice fresh deck boards in. And put in a new privacy wall. It was, remember it was like the painted, <laughs> everything was painted and, really and ugly. And chipped and repainted and chipped yeah. and repainted. And there was like just patchwork done. It looked terrible. And it went and all the way around here. It was, uh, yeah, horrible. Yeah, I think there used to be a hot tub here. So they had it all yeah. rigged up a weird way, but now a nice new modern uh, privacy wall to uh, mm -hmm. kind of just give some privacy from the neighbors and a nice new deck. So yeah. an awesome place to come out here and barbecue and just uh, enjoy time with friends and family. Yeah. All right, guys, that is it. Thank you for checking out the video. We hope you liked it. We had a lot of bumps in the road with this one. But which one doesn't? But it turned out amazing. If you want to see what this place looked like before, click here to watch the before video. Make sure to follow us on Instagram where we post all of our real estate investing journey at Legacy Home Investments. And of course, hit that like button and subscribe so you can see more videos just like this one. We'll see you next time. <laughs> we gotta figure out how to walk in the house. You're just trying to create a blooper reel, aren't you?